Now, one of Yoon Sog Yol's first tasks as president will be to bring South Korea out of the pandemic and hopefully back to some semblance of normalcy. By the time he takes office in May, Korea is expected to be past the peak of this wave. Uh, but dealing with what's left of it and any future health crises, uh, he's pledged to better explain to the public how the government decides on social distancing rules and such like. Our uh, Shin Yeun tells us more on what uh, will possibly take place in terms of COVID-19 when the new president takes office in May. Overcoming COVID-19, a key assignment for President-elect Yoon suk yeol as soon as he comes into office in May. And this is how Yoon plans to do it. Yoon said this committee will ease distancing measures so that they're still effective in tackling the virus but also don't damage the economy. He also pledged to thoroughly explain to the public the scientific evidence the government uses to make decisions on distancing measures. Some health experts agreed on the need for decisions based on science. Health authorities should have explained why it was OK to meet in groups of four but not in five, and stay out at restaurants and cafes till 9 p.m. rather than 10. The new administration should ease antivirus measures based on scientific evidence. To do that, they need to listen to different field experts. The new administration needs to share the latest information on this virus, like any new symptoms or what led to deaths in certain age groups. This will minimize the inconvenience felt by the public. Another key part of Yoon's COVID-19 strategy will be helping those hit hardest by the pandemic, particularly small business owners. Yoon said he would first determine how much financial damage merchants have faced. His administration is set to secure a budget of 50 trillion won, or around 40 billion U.S. dollars, to compensate business owners. Yoon suk yeol will come into office in May, a time when health experts believe the COVID-19 situation will have stabilized after its peak. Accordingly, the president-elect also pledged to prepare for any new health crises in the future by expanding support on the medical front. This includes investing more in research and development for vaccines and treatments. Shin Yeun. Arirang News.